Hello, it is I, Bernard Anderson, and today we will be discussing the urban legend known as the Warden of Burnbeck Halls. This urban legend may have caught your interest in my friend Dark Moon 2's Urban Legend Iceberg, which she did a fantastic job creating. But anyway, the Warden of Burnbeck Halls was an urban legend that has been spread around quite recently in the area of Western Supermare in England, and it was reported as early as 2019 to 2021, most recently. The reports of students who live in this area suggest that if you're awake between the hours of 12 and 5 a.m., that you will see a strange orange light underneath your door, and if you don't hide yourself immediately in your wardrobe, or underneath your bed, or even in your bed, or just completely try to hide yourself in darkness, then apparently this creature will open up your door and drag you to the depths of the underworld. And this has apparently caused students to go missing in the area, and from the student house itself, to never return back to their life. This creature is often referred to as the Warden of Burnbeck Halls, as it goes after those who cause noise in the late hours of the night, like it's trying to solve some kind of misjustice to those who are trying to sleep. Now, is this urban legend any true? Well, there's no actual missing persons cases in the area quite recently, and I'm not seeing any students who've gone missing from this student's accommodation, so it is very unlikely that any students have gone missing due to the Warden. But there is very little photos and very little amounts of documentation of this urban legend which show this creature even existing. So it's very hard to find any information on this creature and what the creature even kind of looks like. However, in my imagination, the Warden's character would look like almost a human mixed with a devil, but they'd be wearing some kind of rustic armour and they'd be wearing some kind of helmet, so you couldn't see into their face. And I would imagine that they would enter into your room behind the hellish light if you got spotted. It would be like almost being caught in some kind of headlight in your room in the darkness, not knowing what to do when this creature steps in. But that's my interpretation of the legend. But if you would like to hear anything else around this kind of area, I would kind of am... Um, a local-ish to this area, along with Dark Moon. So if you'd like to see more on this kind of stuff, make sure to hit that like button, comment and subscribe. And if you didn't like this video, make sure to hit that dislike button nice and hard. And this has been Bernard Anderson, and good night.